Welcome to the awesome, I'm Big Roy and this is Marvel Strike Force. So I got another stockpile built up to open, to test my RNG seed theory some more, get some more data. I did open a legendary full piece out of a purple raid orb, so I'm going to see if that carries over to the other ones. It might not since it's in a different section, it's raid orbs. So let's open these gold ones and see... Nope, green. Because I have been opening the three gold orbs at a time and I didn't hit the million green again okay one last one and green again okay so it probably doesn't carry over let's try red stars just to see if we get anything good and we start with a two and there's a four but it's for a crappy minion so not that good. A two and a three. Seems to be a decent seed. But I think I want to try to get more data of claiming the raid season milestones, see if that changes it up. So I think I'm gonna go try that and see just to get more data for the doubters and naysayers. Which is perfectly fine. You're free not to believe in the RNG seed theory, even though it's worked for me and many other people, with more people telling me every day how it worked for them and thanking me. But you can feel free to disagree. But if your only argument against my fun little theory is making personal attacks against me, you need to sort yourself out. Alright, so we tested that out. Let's see if that changes what we're going to get. Alright, starting with a two. And a one. Little leg there. And another one. Let's do one more. And a two. So it looks like it changed it for a crappier one. So let's try this again. And see if we can change it once again. Claim that bad boy right there. Let's see what we get. Boom. All right, there's a three. Nice little improvement there. And a two. The arm disappeared. I like playing with the timing of the arm just for fun. Let's try some though. Let's try the War Initiative Orb. Let's see what we get here. Oh, bam! There we go. There's a purple 16 War Machine Orb. Do we have a good one? Alright, Assault. Still need that. <laughs> there we go. Another purple. Now I got a 14. It's looking good. Got a green Ant-Man. Blah. All right, there's a, all right, vision, still need that. And boom, there we go, there's the legendary RNG seed theory, baby. Very good one. Let's keep it going. All right, so he's already maxed. We got any more good ones in here? And we end it with an 18 epic. That's what I'm talking about, 93, War Machine. So this looks like a pretty good one. What was that three epics and a legendary on the war machine? All right, so back to the red stars. Let's get a three. Then a one. Finally got something from my Iron Man after all this time and all the orb pulls. My Avengers have been very crappy on the pulls. All right, so it's not going too well with the red stars. Getting twos and ones. If I'm not getting a good roll on those, I like to pop out and go to another one. Because as you just saw with the War Initiative, it's coming in clumps. Alright, so we got two blue and a green. Now, like on these, I don't care as much, so I'll just pull all these. Just been saving them up, need to finally do it. Hopefully, we'll get some good ones. There's a blue. There we go. There's a purple 13. And a green. There's another purple. All right. Getting a nice little clump 
right there again. And there's another one. We are rolling definitely a nice little seed we got here. And another blue. And this is really what most people should shoot for if they're trying out the RNG seed theory, trying to find a good one. Because even if you do get a legendary one like I got on my last video, you still need a ton of orbs to try to take advantage of it. So a lot of people might not want to save up tons of orbs, like, like they're not patient enough. So this is what you want to shoot for. You want to try to get a legendary or epic. Then you can pull the rest. Hopefully you can get some nice clumps. All right, let's try Red Star again. We got three Loki. Where's my arm? All right, two Miss Marvel. I need more on her. Let's do one more. Little lag spike there. And a one. All right, let's hop out of here. I'm going to open my premiums. They were saying Carnage was coming there. We didn't know if he's going to be a jackpot. That was a nice little operative, which I still need. But I saw in a data mine that he might unlock at 100 now. Ooh, there we go. Thanos still need that. There's a 25. All right, 25 Loki. That's what I'm talking about. What was I saying? Oh, yeah. Um, so it was in a data mine that Carnage unlocks at 100 now. So he might not go in premium, or he might not be a jackpot, or he might come in a different manner. So I'll probably pay for this. And they'll throw them in premium orbs like a day after this comes out. But hey, last time I tried to get Loki and I never got the jackpot with him. So I usually don't get that. So I have lost my patience on the premium orbs. All right, so we'll stop there. 15, Operative, Thanos, 25, Loki. So pretty good. Let's go back to the Red Stars. Come on, we need something good. There we go. Uh, that is very nice. I'll go with my seven red star fury very nicely. And then a one. And a two. And a two. Hmm. I'm going to hop out and then let's open some more premiums. Daredevil already maxed. There we go, some more Thanos. Still need to get him to seven. He didn't quite get there. So I am thankful to get some Thanos. I am getting a lot of stuff I already, already have max though, so not a big fan of that. And Deadpool's at seven already. There we go, Miss Marvel. Still need to get her to seven. There's a 25, but it's for Hand Archer. All right, big pun. Still need to get him to seven. That was kind of laggy there. Bullseye. Still need to get him to seven. Also, there's a 25. But he's maxed. Nice. I'm getting 25 on things I already have maxed. Ooh, still need the Oracle. There's another 25. And <laughs> it's for a crappy minion. When you get better than normal rolls, but they're for crappy minions. Gotta love that. Come on, let's get something good. <laughs> and they get aim. That That is not good. That's not what I'm talking about. Scarlet Witch, who I also have maxed. Alright, we're gonna stop that for now. We got Thanos in there. Miss Marvel, Punisher, Kree Oracle. So a few decent ones I still need. Let's go back to the red star. Come on. And a two. All right, so it looks like when you get a duplicate, that makes the arm disappear every time. Let's test that out. That will really make it hard to play with the, the arm timing once you get dupes on everything. All right, there's a three. All right. So my Iron Man finally getting some red star love. Okay, so even when it upgrades, it makes the arm go bye-bye. Hmm. All right, what else do I got here? I got like one Elite. We will come back to that. I got some Ultimus saved up. Let's see how we go with here. All right, Cable. Could be worse. 
And we've got the double two poles on the Ultimus, but Electra. So that could have been better. Korath is maxed. There we go, Pyro. Still need him. That's a nice little pull. And Venom, I don't have him at 7, so I'll take that. I have gotten the Ultimus Legendary 15 pull three different times, so I've had some pretty good luck on that one. Let's see if we can do it again. Cable again. He's still not 7, so maybe once they bring out some more mutants, some X-Men, he might become a little better. Hopefully. And my maxed crossbones, who's been maxed for a lot of months now. So, decent number of Ultimus. Got the Pyro and the Venom. Could have been worse. Alright, let's finish off these Red Stars. Got a two. And the arm is gone. I, I want to play with my arm timing, man. There we go. Two War Machine dupe. Yeah. What else? All right, we'll go back in. Come on. Let's go. So the arm timing isn't really the the seed theory. That's just for fun. Just playing around with the timing of that. Finally got something for my Drax. <laughs> a measly one red star. There's. There's quite a few uh, high characters I have. Oh, there's a four, but it's for a mercenary sniper. That seems to be the theme. <laughs> is you get better than regular pulls, but they're for crappy minions. Yeah. All right. We're going to change this up one more time. It's a pretty good seed, but we're going to see if it changes things around by claiming this last raid milestone. Maybe we'll get lucky, pull another legendary or a nice epic. Let's get these uh, red stars. Come on. We got four left. Give me something good. Yeah, that's a three. That was kind of laggy. I'm going to restart. All right, so we've restarted. We got three red stars to go. Uh, we'll see what it looks like because... I theorized that restarting the game might change it too. Ooh, there we go. <laughs> no, I think we're on the same one still because there's another four star for a crappy minion. I'll take it for the Punisher. That's the first time I got it on that. And dupe. All right. So, well, we got that four red star operative. That was nice. We got one elite. Come on. Here we go. Can't get as good as I got last time, but give me something good. Come on. Epic. All right. All right. Nice little boost of my Black Panther, one of my favorite characters. I will take that. Going with the theme of, if, of it could have been worse. <laughs> that is what we're doing. Let's finish all these premium orbs. I probably should save them. But I will wait no longer. There's a 25. Actually, you do need the Wasp because I think there's another event coming with her. So, definitely need to get her to 7 still. Another 25. Getting lots of cable this run. Oh, there we go. 15 Sabretooth. It's very nice. Gamora's maxed. Alright, 25 Groot. Need that too. I think he was in the, uh, the Data Mind event coming up too. So always like to get him. My nemesis Luke Cage, who I've gotten thousands of shards for. <laughs> and my max night nurse. Ooh, lots of 25. Oh yeah, 25 vision. That's what I'm talking about. Give me all of them vision shards. Ah, oh, he's maxed. The other Kree minions, come on. No, Drax is maxed. All, all blue. A triple blue pull. Ugh, crappy aim. Whoop, too fast. Whoop, medic. Another medic. Back to back. I wish I would have got back to back on something I still needed. That would be nice. But my medic has been maxed for a very long time now. So. There we go. Assault. Still need that. Alright, saber tooth again. That will work. Alright. Soldier. 
and Hydra. And JJ, who's also maxed. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Cree Oracle still need her. Oh, oh crap! And I just waited for ah, waste. I can't even talk anymore. I just wasted 450 power cores on the boomer who I already have maxed. So there we go, boys and girls. Very, very nice. Lots of Ultimus. Ooh, I can open two more, looks like. So that that was the theme of this pulling session was it could have been worse. Ooh, I need that for my iron fist to get him to 13 one day. I'll take that. All right, let's go open those two Ultimus orbs, see if we can end this on a good note. Maybe we'll get a 15 Ultimus. That would be very nice. I would like that. All right, Max Spider-Man, come on. Let's end with something good. Hit. All right, Black Widow, still need her. Unlike my Masters of Launch podcast co-host, Chuberger, I did not have her at 7, so I will gladly take some more Black Widow. All right, let's look at these red stars. I only promote the ones I use a lot because uh, I still am assuming that they're going to do the Alliance War matchmaking based on your Alliance's collection power, total collection power. So that's why I'm trying to keep mine as low as possible if they do indeed do that. Now, if they do it some other way, then I'll apply all these and call it a day. But for now, I'm all about helping my Alliance as much as I can. All right, so let's recruit those two. All right, I already recruited him. That's a nice little visual bug there. Definitely going to promote my Black Panther. Nice little, like, 6,000 health and 800 damage boost. I will definitely take that. You want to max out his damage as much as possible. Maybe one day I'll get him 5, 6, or 7. Definitely the operative boost up my shield team. To go with my one day seven red star fury. He's still five. What else we got here? All right, Iron Man finally got some on him. I still use him quite a bit here and there in raids and in bullets, of course. And he might go very well with War Machine. So I'm going to promote him. Let's see. I'll do Yondu. I don't use him anywhere near as much as I used to. He was in the OG raid team, not anymore. There are much better options, but it's only one extra star. We'll do Punisher. I used him to one star the tag node in the Ultimus 65 raid video I did, so you can check that out if you haven't already. Drax I used quite a bit, so we're going to apply that massive one red star to him. <laughs> That's a little boost. It's better than nothing. And I think that's it. Yeah, that's all I'm going to promote. That's going to do it. Thanks for watching. No Insane 7 Red Star pull again, but I didn't expect to get that. We did get lots of good pulls, and we got some more data points to test the theory. So it is all good. Test out the RNG seed theory if you like. Let me know how it goes for you. And until next time, stay tuned and stay awesome.